I done been through all that. I don't put my children above yours. My children gonna make mistakes just like yours. That's right. That's right. That's and I right. tell the church folk, don't do my family like many of these churches do theirs. They are the first family. My right. family ain't no first family. Right, right, right. My family is part of God's family. That's right. That's right. Amen. My Amen. children sneak and do things like yours. Yeah. Yeah. Amen. Oh, well, you're a man of God. Anytime God is our father. That's right. And you do things in his face. His face. What about your children? Amen. That's right. That's right. Amen. I remember when my oldest daughter was in high school. She's been out now about nine years. We don't go to prom. But my oldest daughter was slick brick. He was slick brick. And, you know, school give, you know, kids projects and they work together as a team. There was one young lady, not saved, but raised up in a good moral house. Very respectful and whatnot. And so we thought our daughter was going over there working on the project and she was slick. Oh, she went out the house dressed holy. Ah. See, when you want to do wrong, your friends will help you. Oh, yeah. So, Brits, she went out. See you later. Hallelujah. Went to a friend's house. Her friends had the clothes ready. Yeah. <laughs> Got all primed up. Yeah. I asked my wife, I said, well, how long are they going to work on the project? Uh -huh. <laughs> Daddy said, well, you know them school projects are long. <laughs> and before I know it, you see, what's done in the dark, God it'll says, come it'll come to light. So the public didn't know what happened. Yeah. They just lied and said, Pastor Jennings let his daughter go on the prom. Yeah. Right. Yeah. No. So I took the lashing. Yeah. Right. So her friends took pictures of her at the prom. Yeah. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. and, and this is how the Holy Ghost worked. Yes, sir. What she thought was friends, yeah. put it all over the internet. Wow. There's Pastor Jennings' daughter. <laughs> and it came to me. I said, that's not my daughter. <laughs> that's not my daughter. <laughs> All them pictures came rolling in. My God, my God. Early, early. Let me write something me. Brother, I jumped in my car and went to Westchester University. Banging my daughter's door. Come out or I huff and I qualify, sir. I said, girl, do you see all these pictures on the internet? She didn't even know it. She said, I thought they were my friends. <laughs> wow. But God allowed it to happen. To show her you cannot do what you want to do and be in check the right thing and get away with it. That's right. So yes, I chastised her, laid her out, and she learned. But I didn't hang it over her head though. When I'm done with something, I'm done with it. That's right. Because I know something else will pop up later. Yeah. But what the false prophets did was download all the pictures and then put it on their website and then add sugar and spice and said, Pastor Jennings allowed his daughter to go on the prom. See, you can't follow someone that take a stand like this and be careless. That's right. 
That's right. Even you, that's not my blood. That's right. If you're in the church of Jesus Christ, you cannot be careless because they're going to blame me even when you are fool. That's right. That's right. They have flipped that thing around and said, oh, he allow it. He allow it. Yeah. Amen. Yeah. They can't touch my gospel. Right. So they say, well, he allowed this now. He allowed that now. Right, right. They don't want the people that do it to take responsibility. No. Man, my daughter was apologizing and kept apologizing and kept, but she learned. She learned from that. And the mistake that many people make, they forget what they done. You may be an adult now, but you was a wicked child. That's right. And some of you are still wicked adults. Amen. Don't put my children up on no pinnacle. I don't put them there. They normal children. They came from an extraordinary woman, but they're normal children. That's what the Bible says, foolishness is bound in the heart of a child. That's right. And then Paul reflected on himself and said, we ourselves also were sometimes foolish. So to this very day, false prophets on the internet, Lord. Took those pictures, and that's over nine years ago, and they still use them. Mm. That's something. They won't touch my gospel, but they will attack my children, attack my wife. One woman, one girl said that my wife should just haul off and die. Mm. This is the hatred. My said Lord. my wife should just haul off and die. My Lord, my Lord. One man that I used to pastor. Yeah. Say he hoped that my children, my girls particularly, never marry, but they all just keep having babies so they will embarrass me and my wife. My Lord, my Lord. This is someone that's supposed to have the Holy Ghost. That's hatred, hatred. They that live godly in Christ Jesus, in Christ Jesus, shall suffer persecution.